Let's take a look at the sweater manufacturing process. Number 1. Yarn Inspection Several parameters need to be detected in this process, including the yarn linear density deviation, evenness, moisture regain and color fastness and so on. These parameters will directly affect the quality of the product. Number 2. Construction This process can be understood as design and programming. The construction man will upload the program, that bases on the yarn material's properties, and the final clothes product desired properties. Number 3. Knitting Sample Before mass production, knitting a sample piece is an essential step. If the knitted sample does not meet the requirements, for example, over-elastic, then it is likely that there are some problems between the yarn specification and the program of the loom, so that the construction needs to be redone. Number 4. Knitting Piece after uploading the program, the loom will automatically knit pieces according to our setting. Typically, loom knitting is the same principle as hand knitting. Number 5. Checking piece. When a piece finishes knitting, the workers will collect it with others, and check if there are any incorrections on color, shape or some things. Those pieces that seem to meet the requirements will be sent to the next department for the next process. Number 6. Linking. In this process, the work to do, is to link together the pieces for different parts of the sweater by the sewing tray. The sewing tray is sewing equipment whose main function is to sew the panels together. After this process, the pieces merge and become a semi-finished product. Number 7. Hand Stitching There are many parts of the sweater, that the machine cannot sew, and there will be extra stitches and thread ends exposed, which needs to be manually cut off. And the excess yarns other than sutures need to be removed by hand. These kinds of work are called hand stitching. Number 8. Dyeing. If a factory is going to produce a solid color sweater, then it probably uses the raw white yarns for knitting. If this is the case, it must contain this dyeing process to dye a specific solid color. Number 9. Washing. Here, the washing process is not the same as daily laundry, cause some additives will be added in for the following purposes. Removing stains and peculiar smell, getting good hand feeling, fastening color, and adjusting shrinkage. The washing process occupies a very important position in the sweater manufacturing process, because the hand feeling of sweaters is mostly controlled by this process. Number 10. Ironing. The purpose of ironing is to shape the product, maintain the style characteristics, have a flat appearance, and have a comfortable hand feeling. The shaping temperature of the sweater is generally 120 Celsius to 180 Celsius. Number 11. Labeling. This process is to sew the customer's label on sweaters. Number 12. Inspecting. The workers will carefully inspect and remove the stains and extra thread some things. Number 13. Mending. If there are any seams or holes on this sweater, then the workers will mend it. Number 14. QC. The QC team needs to make sure that the yarn material in the sweater is correct and that there is no color difference in the sweater and that the sweater's appearance is flat and tidy. Number 15. Packing. After all other processes, the final sweater products are going to be perfect logically. And they will be packed up and sent to the customers.